So it's about uh, 6.30 in the morning. I actually have today off and I'm up extra early. <laughs> So, uh, something a little bit different today. Uh, not really a day trip, but uh, it is a free day. <laughs> it's actually been a while since I've actually had a day off, like for business hours. So I'm going to check some registered mail I should have picked up about a month ago <laughs> and visit another post office, which uh, has a, a package for some uh, equipment that I ordered. And just figure out why it's, it's sort of been sitting there and it hasn't been sort of delivered to the uh, office, so to speak. Wow, happy free day. <laughs> So I just got back from post office number one and the registered mail that I thought it was like my energy bill uh, I saw on the screen it's from the Ministry of Interior uh, That's what I should have picked up which is basically tied to my permanent residency application I'm pretty sure they're just doing the usual check to make sure I am at the registered address that I said I was and that's usually how they do it But I thought it was an energy bill and really haven't had time and I've been putting it off and till today But of course it's too late to pick it up I think everything is going to be okay. She said something about uh, having it resent. Hopefully, it should not disrupt uh, the permanent residency application. For now, I think I'm just going to do something else a little bit unusual. Uh, I'm going to head to the gym. Uh, yeah, the Dloha chas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so yeah, I'm going to see my volume and then it's going Ah, so feeling pretty refreshed. Uh, I'm sure I'll be sore tomorrow. <laughs> it's been a while. So now I'm off to post office number two to figure out why a package that I ordered uh, is still there. So the tracking, I ordered it uh, middle of October and it arrived a couple weeks later, beginning of November, and it's still there. <laughs> a couple phone calls and they said that uh, they weren't sure why it wasn't shipping out, why it wasn't being delivered. So on my way now to see if it is still there, <laughs> I hope. <laughs> So I've been here once before to pick up a package uh, that had to go through customs. There's sort of three different places. Uh, one for regular mail, which is on the first floor. Another place you must sort of uh, go in to like claim or check or get the receipt. And then a third room, you sort of wait in a little queue to do the payment. And then back to the second room to with your receipt to get the package. So I, I think I figured it all out the last time. It took about an hour. <laughs> Um, uh, brown sugar. Uh, yeah, I have a little bit of 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 a little bit um, but the tracking says that it didn't leave here, so I'll wait till Monday and I'll maybe check with reception downstairs and again with the office. So for the moment, I'm going to head back over to Karlina Zhishkov district. I'm meeting up with a couple other people. We're going to do a bit of a photo walk and discuss some ideas for uh, maybe social, uh, social experiments and documentary projects. So that'll be a bit interesting. The hours. 
not open on Fridays. Interesting. <laughs> so as we're like on a Friday, everything is usually open and it's wonderful to have like a business day off. And the best strudel in Europe, so we've heard, is this uh, strudel. But anyways, we'll keep doing photo walk and yeah, there's Jan doing photo walk. <laughs> Happy fun Friday, but no strudel. Hey. <laughs> Okay, so yeah, I was here in uh, March, maybe earlier this year, and just working on a sequence. For a project. And wow, he was here 23 years, and it's closed. Uh, it's empty. So I don't know wherever he is, I hope he's okay, and it was nice to have met him. So do you have a story you'd like to share? Uh, something like getting a parcel, sending a parcel? Uh, feel free to leave a video comment on the link below. That one there.